good morning today i thought i would show you what a day looks like when i'm in the van when i'm not out on about traveling anywhere and i'm just based at home so just if you have not been around here before let me just explain my situation i do have a house i'm actually parked on the driveway of my house right now but it is being renovated and so there's nothing in there there's no kitchen there's no bathrooms there's no bedroom there's no anything and i did have a van but it conked out on me needed a new engine that's on the driveway just over there i need to sort it out and like, get rid of it but i bought a new van and i'm in the middle of converting it and at the moment i am living in this van pretty much really and so yeah that is my current situation it is what time is it 10 past seven just woken up i think it's gonna be an absolutely beautiful day so i don't honestly want to be like sat in the van like working or whatever all day but we'll we'll just see how it goes i do have to have a bit of a tidy up in the van i was away over the weekend a lovely weekend at, um in Southport, just we had a park up by the beach and it was it was lovely. But um right now I am gonna what am I gonna do? <laughs> I'm gonna go to the gym first off I reckon. I need to do a workout, I need to get a shower and then we can clean the van and stuff after that. I'm trying to <laughs> find my gym stuff. It's hard work in this van because I've literally just got just got a double mattress in here there's no cupboards there's no anything so everything all my stuff is just thrown down here at the bottom it is in a bit of chaos at the moment with having been away but where's my clothes but there it is oh. i need to find some socks for the gym oh there we go i feel really tired i don't think i slept very well i'm not sure oh It is hot and it's like quarter past seven. I'll just show you the house so you can see that there's, like it's not livable in. There's nothing. <laughs> no kitchen. No, no anything at the moment. This is where the bathroom's gonna be. Nothing there. <laughs> I'll have a quick, quick look upstairs. Nowhere to sleep, see? <laughs> this is my bedroom what will be my bedroom <laughs> so yeah that's why i'm living in the van at the moment because this is the way that it is and to be honest i would be quite happy just to get rid of this house and go live in my van <laughs> full time is how i'm feeling right now i think it's definitely definitely a future plan quiet this morning feel all nice and refreshed now i've had a shower although to be honest i'm starting to get all sweaty again in the car um i'm now just driving around to my sister's house she lives like two minutes from the gym i'm gonna like get the van all organized and sort it out when i pull up there i was gonna do it in the car park but i felt i like parked right in the middle of the car park and i felt a little bit on show so <laughs> i'll go down to her house first thing i want to do is get my battery out with the solar panel and get it charging because it's lovely i've just stuck it down here pass some sun out the van That feels a bit better. I've got my washing that I need to get organised. And my rubbish to stick in the bin. Right, I was at the beach this weekend and there's just sand everywhere. So I think I need to take this off and give it a shake out. I 
changed my mind on just giving it a shake out. I'm gonna go wash it. Just gonna. All right, that old tidy will do for now. I'm at my sister's house and you could say that this is kind of cheating a little bit in terms of like full time van living but I've put my washing on I mean I could just go to a laundry but I'll put it on here and I'll just give her a little bit of money for that and I am just doing a bit of cooking it's mainly for my son to be honest but I am just cooking up a little bit of um, some vegetables and things just for ease so I don't have to cook in the van because as you see like I haven't if I had a set up in the van and a proper kitchen and everything then I would do it in the van but because I've just got the mattress I can't really do that at the moment very easily so I'm just cooking off a few little bits here I'm eating this now whilst I'm finishing off cooking I'm making a pasta salad for Steve and my son this is just vegetables and some tempeh breakfast hi it is a hot one <laughs> I am all done at my sister's house. Um, left the washing on the line a little bit. I need to go back later on to collect it because it's got my, um, well, my sheets and my gym stuff and stuff that I need for in the morning. I am gonna go, um, I'm gonna head to my house. It's just like a five minutes drive away. See if the builders are there. And if the builders aren't there, I'm gonna park on the drive and I can just like plug my laptop in and stuff and work there maybe. I've just drove past the house and the builders are there so <clears throat> and they're on the drive and that so I'm gonna plan B to find somewhere just to park up. I don't know where. Found somewhere just here kind of in the shade a little bit. I'm right by the field as well so I can go for a little walk a little bit in the sun but for now get in here and do some work. Right, got my laptop set up. The main problem I'm gonna have, or I usually have, <laughs> is power because you can see now I've plugged in my laptop. I have 2.3 hours, that'll go down to like one hour in a minute and my laptop is ridiculous and doesn't hold charge. So I probably will have to get the solar panel out and stick the solar panel out somewhere which I don't massively like doing, but it's must. I'll probably actually just put it on my roof. I'll do that actually. I'll, yeah, I'll put it up on my roof. I hadn't, I've never thought of that before. <laughs> I'll do that. This is not easy to do at all. Oh, I'm going to fall. Okay. Right, I've got to drag it across. Drag it across to this way. Hopefully. Yeah, it was in the shade over there. Let's see if we're pulling anything in. Oh yeah, we're pulling something in now. I've got 13 hours. That'll do. I'm just taking a little break from work, have a little wander in the field. It's just down there, see? It's lovely here. A bit cloudy though. Sun's behind those clouds. It's not good for my solar panel. <laughs> Maybe I should move from those trees. Right, back in the van. I think I'm just going to film a little quick video about the costs of van life or how much it has cost me in the past four weeks kind of living in this van. So I'm going to set that up film that now uh, i'm getting no solar charge whatsoever here so i think i need to move well i know i need to move because this don't work for me no wonder i'm not getting any solar i'm completely in the shade get this off the roof now bloody hell hang on the wires on the other side
Look at the crack in my windscreen. Can you see it? Can't really see it. Let me go inside. I'll show you. So I can't really see it, but like it started there. Yeah, you can. Yeah, there you go. Started there, and it's spread all the way down there, and all the way around there as well. So I'm going to phone up for a quote on it. Oh, it's going to cost me a fortune. Hi, yeah. I was looking at getting a quote on a crack in my windscreen, please. It's a uh, Vivaro. 215 fitted. I got a quote the other day from Autoglass and it was 550. Going with these guys. Oh my God, that's the best news I've had for ages. There's just no space. No space. The bed takes up the whole... A whole van. Phone's ringing. Oh. Hiya. Hello. Hi. How much is milk? <laughs> no idea, to be honest with you. <laughs> How much have you just paid? 155 sound alright. Well, it's expensive, but it's corner shop kind of prices, yeah. Oh, that's a chore. Right. <laughs> Bed all good, no. I reckon I'm just going to chill in the van a little bit now. I do need to eat something. I did bring, this is a bit where I kind of like cheat really with the whole like living in a van full time because I have got some food that I prepared at my sister's house this morning that I'll probably just heat up on a stove just out there on my drive because there's no other to do in here. Like, I would do that if I was out and about. Like, I quite often park up next to, um, like, a wall or something where no one's walking past and I can just get my stove out and just heat something up a little bit there or even cook something. I might do that. Although, I'm not that hungry. To be honest, I've just had, like, a banana and an apple. And I know that's not a lot of food, but <laughs> I'm quite full right now. So, I'll leave it for now and see if I get hungry a bit later. I'm just going to relax. might watch a film. A friend recommended... Um, the Queen film on Netflix, so I might just relax for a little bit and watch that. Okay, I'm getting a bit peckish now, it's like half past seven, and I could heat this up but honestly, I can't be bothered. <laughs> it was just some of the vegetables with some like, it's like stir fried vegetables with some tempeh. I'm gonna eat it cold. It's fine. <coughs> Nailed the lips there. So far, so far we're okay. See, Don't no touch reason. the eyes. Do not touch me. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm going to be watching you. 